I'm going to show you how I cut up my live streams on Twitch into highlights. You can make markers during live streams. Use slash marker and then give the marker a description. You can write how long the segment is. So you know how far to look back from the marker. You can see how I title my highlights. The most recent highlight that was finished is January 20th. We only need to look for a VOD after that date. You only need to do the ones with markers next to them. See how the 26th doesn't have any markers? You don't need to do that one. Click on highlight. It will open up a new tab. Rename the highlight as I did. Click on your first marker. Drag the playhead where the marker is. You can click here to zoom in on the timeline. Now we just cut the segment. It might take a little bit to figure out what content we're looking for. Now, when I leave markers, it won't have a description because I hit a button on Stream Deck, so it will just be empty. So it seems like I figured out what the content is. We're gonna click end segment at playhead now we click to zoom out so we can see the other markers the timeline also shows clips in case we want to include that but you're going to select your next marker or location where you'd like to include in the highlight we're going to click add new segment do not click add new highlight it makes an entirely new video we want to hit add new segment and it creates another segment at the playhead wherever you clicked I want to note when cutting, it's better to have an extra five seconds at the start and end of segment because when we're editing, we'd like a little bit of extra footage just in case we want to make edits to it. It's a lot better. The main thing is we don't want to cut the content too short in case we do need to make edits to it. So here I am reviewing the second marker and this is the content that I was looking for. You can preview all the segments with the purple play button. So it'll play just the segments that you cut out. I forgot to record this part, but if you don't like a segment, all you need to do is click on that segment and then hit the trash bin icon over here and it'll delete your segment. Once you've reviewed all the footage and you're satisfied, you can just hit publish highlights. It will begin processing the video in the same tab in your browser. Do not close the tab or refresh the page until it's finished. Okay, do not close the tab or refresh the page until it is finished. You can see here it's still processing. While it is processing, you can work on the next VOD if there's more markers to put into highlights. Just do the same steps as before. can see now that it's done processing. You can now close the tab. Make sure to unpublish the highlight that you just finished.
And that's it.